Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today's first question is which of the following is not a polymer and you have to choose one of these answers. Take a look at this picture. We can see here DNA, double-stranded DNA and single-stranded RNA. Both these molecules, variant B and D of the answers are made of the repetitive units of the nucleotides. So this is example of the polymer. And now let's consider, for example, starch. And here's a picture of the starch. And you also see that starch is made of the repetitive units of the glucose. And here's the molecule of the glucose. So you see now that glucose, which is answer C, is not example of the polymer. So this is going to be our choice and all the rest are polymers. Now we can move to the next question. The starch is composed of and again we have to choose the correct answer. Starch we can find in most green plants. It is used in order to store energy and we can find it especially in tubers and in seeds. For example in rice, in potato, and it's made of two types of the polymers. And polymers of the sugar, which is glucose, and one variant of the polymer is branched, we call this amylopectin, and another one is unbranched, we call this amylose. Amylose make about 20%, so let's put 20% here and amylopectin about 80%. So from plant to plant, from species to species, these percentages can slightly fluctuate, but now you have idea that is made by two type of polymers. And by the way, amylopectin also resembles glycogen, which we humans use in order also to store energy and it is a form of the amylopectin but more branched. We store energy in fats, this is long term storage, but if we need immediately energy it would be used in a form of the glycogen. But now let's choose the correct answer, so as you see it is branched amylopectin and unbranched amylose. So this is answer C. And this is all for today. Subscribe and see you in the next video. Goodbye.